In this video, I am going to discuss about introduction to the machines and the definition of a kinematic element. Theory of machines is a subject that deals with the analysis of uh, different machines. So a machine is a device that can transform one form of energy into useful work. For example, if you take a reciprocating steam engine as in the following case, reciprocating steam engine converts a heat energy into rotary motion with the help of the crank. Now, this machine consists of a number of parts like cylinder, piston, piston rod, connecting rod, crank and so on. So we can say a machine consists of number of parts. If each part of a machine moves relative to some other part then it is known as a kinematic link. So this kinematic link must be a resistant body and need not be a rigid body. So the difference between rigid body and a resistant body is if the deformation in the body is zero then it is called as a rigid body. If the deformation produced in a body is negligible then it is called as a resistant body. So every time the kinematic link need not be a need not be in motion Sometimes it can also be in stationary position. For example, if you take uh, this reciprocating steam engine, so piston, piston rod, and the cross head combination is a first link. So this piston, piston rod, cross head, we can say it is a first link because the velocity is same, and the connecting rod is a second link, crank is a third link. These are elements most related to some other part. But if you observe, cylinder and engine frame and main bearings are the are in a stationary position. We can call it as a fourth link. Therefore, a reciprocating steam engine consists of a four links. Piston, piston rod and cross head is a first link and connecting rod is a second link, crank is a third link. Cylinder, engine frame and main bearings are fourth link. So there are different types of links like rigid link, flexible link, fluid link and so on. So rigid link means if there is any deformation, if there is no deformation produced in the body then it is called as a rigid body. But practically there are no rigid bodies. In universe rigid body doesn't exist. When coming to the flexible link, if you find any partly deformation in a body, then it is known as a flexible link. For example, if you take a, a belt, a rope, wi wires and so on, you can find partly deformation in the body. Whereas a fluid link is the one which is formed by having a fluid in container and the motion is transmitted through the fluid by pressure. Example jacks, fluid jacks can we say is, a, uh, is an example of a fluid link. You can observe the fluid links in JCBs, earth movers and so on. 